Avi Myers here, Northtown Neighborhood News Magazine, and today is Judicial Day. Dial us up on the World Wide Web at ntnm.org, run by our entire technical crew, Sonny Hirsch, where at this point in time, over 18,000 of you have actually watched shows on the web. It's pretty cool. And of course, since we're talking about judges, it always helps to mention that we're big fans of CAPS over here. And uh, you can go to all the CAPS sites for the neighborhood in Rogers Park and West Rogers Park at caps24.org. And of course, going to our website at ntnm.org, you can get all the different cities and times and locations the show's on in, in many suburbs throughout the county. It is a pleasure and privilege to have somebody who comes very highly recommended. As a matter of fact, a frequent <coughs> guest on the show, Jim Nelly, speaks absolutely the world of him. We're talking about Judge Thaddeus Wilson. Thank Judge, you. How are you? Pretty good. Nice to meet you and glad to be on the show. First of all, my pleasure. Now, you are a sitting judge right now. Yes, I am. And what, what, uh, what, I mean, how long have you been a judge and what kind of court do you have? Well, I was appointed to the bench by the Illinois Supreme Court uh, back on, uh, was sworn in on August 31st of this year. So fairly new on the, on the bench and uh, assigned to the traffic division where all new judges are assigned. Mm -hmm. And so I've been hearing your regular uh, traffic violations, speeding, red lights, stop signs. And then we also do DUIs and driving on suspended revoked license. So, you know, um, you can go anywhere from a petty offense to up to 364 days in the Cook County Jail wow. when you're dealing with traffic court, believe it or not. That's, I do believe it because one time I got hauled over for going a little bit too fast on Western <laughs> Avenue. And thank God I, I had a good lawyer and the judge was kind to me. <laughs> well, we try to be kind in traffic court. We try to be kind to everyone and courteous to everyone and dealing with uh, a matter because for a lot of people it's their first time uh, dealing with the court system on a, a, a speeding ticket or, or minor traffic infraction. And so they're, they're terrified and don't understand the system, whatever. So we, we try to be accommodating and, and uh, careful and as gentle as possible and considerate when dealing with uh, citizens. Which I think is great. I, you also have to be able to, I can imagine you're meeting a really wide range of people and hearing a wide array of cases. Absolutely. There's some, some days you may, in, in, depending on what courtroom you're in, you may hear anywhere from 100 to 400 cases wow. a, a day. And so, you know, we're talking major calls, and you have to be, have a system in place to go through those calls, to be able to, to listen and give everybody a chance to, 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 to have their say and get their point out, but to manage it so that you can get through the calls. Otherwise, it would be impossible to get through some of these calls. Um, just the, the call I did today, over 300 cases today. So it's, it's nonstop from 9 o'clock really until 3.30, 4 o'clock. Sometimes you can be there until 5, 6 o'clock trying cases. Wow. And so uh, you have to be able to manage the call. It's, it's high intensity, um, high volume, and you have to be able to manage the call and deal with a whole wide array with people. Some people, it's their first time in court. Others, they are old pros and hats at being in the system, <laughs> unfortunately. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm very grateful that I haven't actually have not had to be in traffic court for about 20 years at this point. <laughs> <laughs> so it sounds good, and it's, it's definitely great experience. Now, circuit court, you you can circuit court is a wide array. You're yes. running for circuit court judge, right? And well, tell us what kind of. Uh... Well, even though I was appointed by the Supreme Court uh, to fill an interim vacancy, my appointment ends December 1st of next year, which is right after the general election. And so in order to keep the seat, I have to run in the primary and in the general election in order to keep the seat. Uh, and what we do as a circuit judge, Cook, we do the entire county. So you can be assigned anywhere. You can be assigned to traffic where most new judges are assigned. You can deal with uh, uh, civil matters or auto accident cases or collection cases. You can deal with criminal courts with that 26 in California or domestic relations or juvenile um, cases so you can you can be assigned anywhere as a judge actually even as an associate judge you can be assigned anywhere and so the, the one of the big difference is that when you're running you know there are countywide spots and they are sub circuit spots in the sub circuit system you have to live within a certain geographical area and you're only running and being voted upon by the systems in that area um, for the countywide spots, you have to run countywide, and everyone in the county is voting for you. You're still the same same judge, a circuit judge, but the sub-circuit and county spots, depending on who's going to be voting for you and where you have to live in order to keep the seat. 
So yeah, you've got, well, in, in your case, you're talking about a, this big county. Yes, it's a big <laughs> county. You really don't know how big the county, you hear people say how big the county is, but when you have to get out here every day like we do and driving the county, some, some days from one end of the county to the other end, after handling a, 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 a big call uh, in court and, and hit a spot, you know, on the north, north side of the county, maybe in, uh, in Schaumburg, and then try to go all the way to the Thornton Township or lines of bloom, uh, it's it's pretty demanding. That's that's a very heavy trip. Yes. I mean, that's um, you you've definitely. It's a good thing you got a GPS. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> absolutely, mm. trusty GPS. Thank goodness. Mm -hmm. No, it definitely has to help. And um, and um, you know, I, I've got to say that yeah, it, it's uh, such a. And it is there. A, it, so there's traffic courts all over the place. It's not just yes. that building downtown. Right, there's traffic courts all over the place. Uh, traffic court in all of the. I think it's uh, six uh, municipal districts. And so, you know, there's traffic court in Markham, there's traffic court in Bridgeview, um, uh, Maywood, Rolling Meadows, Skokie. So there's traffic court in all of those different municipal districts. That's just about everywhere. Right. That's, that's so, uh, well, first of all, I want to let everybody know if people want to contact your campaign or, or and we have to, first of all, you should understand that, that these guys are, these, these people are judges. They are, this is, like they can't do the soapbox thing the way the state reps and the congressman <laughs> people do it. So so I have to be careful about that. But um, first of all, I want to thank you very much, Judge Thaddeus Wilson. And my, all my legal experts say that, you know, like he's a really good man and, and they'd like to very much see him, uh, you know, stay on the bench. So so a vote along those lines would be, would be wonderful. Um, it, are you allowed to say anything that, like campaign? Uh, absolutely. We, the only things we are not allowed to do is talk about uh, campaign finance as judges. So they tie our hands <laughs> behind our back when it comes to raising money. But in terms of getting out our word, you know, we have our uh, website and we have literature out, uh, thaddeusforjudge.com, T-H-A-D-D-E-U-S-F-O-R-J-U-D-G-E.com for judge. We have literature out. I'm also part of uh, a slate of candidates so that you can go out and look for the, the whole slate of candidates. Uh, I've been a practicing attorney for 13 years. I have a wide uh, variety and diverse background from criminal law, domestic relations, bankruptcy, foreclosure, and uh, civil rights. And so that's one thing, thing about my background that allows me to understand and deal with a lot of different areas. Um, At this point, I, as much as I like to let you go on, I've got to leave room for the other judges. I understand, no problem. So, and by the way, Jim <laughs> Nelly thinks the world of him, and you guys all know Jim Nelly is a frequent guest and a co-host on our live shows. Thank you so much, Judge Wilson. We wish you luck in the election. Thank you. And uh, of course, you can read about him in your free copy of Jewish Chicago. Thanks, Sonny. Thank you.